Welcome to our podcast, episode 45 on Among Us. I had to do it eventually, god damn it. It's, uh, I know what's going to be in the comments, like sus, sussy baka, sussy, uh, just all, all, all the, the sus vent sus, Among Us, Among Us, uh, just everything, everything that could be there will be there probably, and it's fun, 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 oh my god, um, yeah, Among Us, uh, is a game that got popular in 2020, um, like, years after it had released because it came out in like 2018 I'm going to say is that right I need to google it but yeah but uh yeah we all know that the game murder your friends or just random strangers um and yeah but I, I, a part of the reason why I'm doing this is to tell you my story. So, um, I already mentioned one in a previous podcast, which is I had to defend a kid with autism from, like, everyone else and eventually convince them, to, like, like, the dumb kids to, like, kick the person that had died at Skittle, so, yeah, so, yeah, goddamn dumb kids, but to be fair, I also was a dumb kid at times, especially with, uh, the one thing, uh, uh, the, the incident, uh, the, the Sabrina thing that I mentioned in, uh, It's Okay to Be Human video, um, where, you know, as kids, sometimes, you know, um, boys will be like, I don't like girls' name, I, I, I fortunately was one of those, um, but I didn't have many other traits like other boys because I I was strange. Yeah, again, I walked into poles so uh, and uh, thought up like a visible maze at the playground. Like I thought up a visible maze. So uh, yeah. Um, uh, it's safe to say I was a very odd kid and not like the odd boys in the most part. Um, but for that aspect, so out of like traits I could have got, I got one of the worst bad traits, but not like too bad. Like I didn't end up becoming like sexist, so you know, um, could have been worse, could have definitely been worse, luckily it was just one of those dumb kid moments while I was a dumb kid, so, yeah, but safe to say that incident, I hurt a friend because of it, but then again, like, a lot of people were just like, basically bullying me, so, you know, I, I was kicking around and kicked the wrong person, so, yeah, kind of sucks, but, yeah, um, 2018, for Among Us, initial release, anyway, um, yeah, but, yeah, we all have dumb moments, we all have whatever, 
anyway, here, here's um another story. So, um, related to the, the friend I have failed. Um, also, yeah, again, relating it back to it's okay to be human video. <laughs> yeah, again, I, I, I think Among Us is tied to my failures as a person. <laughs> it's odd. Odd coincidences. Some things are just weirdly tied together, like how in a previous thing, like Tricky Stand, Rogers are very, like, oddly tied together. So, yeah. I'm guessing that means I should avoid Among Us. <laughs> Key thing for me not failing in life, don't play Among Us, but I did do a good thing in Among Us, so it's like a 50-50. It's like a coin flip. I either have a chance to help out dumb kids or I either mess up myself. But, um, yeah, it was with m m my old friends, Joker, the friend that I failed because I became impatient with the joke um, of they had this other friend I think their name was Duck or something um, and they thought I had a brother because I would use my phone as like a second account um, and I claimed it was my brother like as a joke but I don't have a brother so it was like an obvious joke. Eventually I got tired of the joke and I was like, hey, it, it's just me controlling both. The ruse is up. It was just me. <laughs> like, our orange puppet five for four two. <laughs> that would be my second channel if I ever had a second channel. But I'm not because I... Um, one of the things is, like, uh, at least me personally, I don't want a second channel unless there's a really good reason. Like, if it's a group thing, like, multiple people together, like, if it's a group thing, like, if I ever start, like, a group channel of sorts with different friends or whatever, like... That warrants a second channel. Like, if it's a second channel, like a group channel, then yes. Podcasts, like, if it's a group podcast, would also be acceptable and within the same boundaries. But I already have my own podcast, so I uh, don't know how likely that is. I mean, I'm literally in the podcast. What do I mean I have my own podcast? We're in the podcast right now. <laughs> I think I forgot that for a second when I said that. <laughs> like, oh yeah, I have a podcast. And meanwhile, recording the podcast currently. <laughs> uh, but, um, yeah. So, I only would do it for... A decent reason, like, a justified reason. Like, if it was to be a big branch out and, like, didn't fit onto my channel. But I already do all sorts of random stuff on my channel. So, yeah. Um, I, I don't think I'm getting a second channel. I mean, I've gone... Two years without one, I think I can do without one for the rest of my YouTube career. Usually, by this point, like, if you've committed long enough, eventually you'll get a second channel. But I haven't. I haven't. Two years and I haven't. So, you can do it too. <laughs> but, um, yeah. But back to Joke and Dark, so, yeah. So I, I've become impatient with the joke and um, would basically 
no longer be friends with Joke and Duck. So yeah. Like, I was trying to explain it, but they just weren't understanding. Like, maybe they were kids too, and I just didn't realize it. Like, they seemed mature, but you never know, you never know. Remember that for those who are younger and experienced, you never know the age of someone. Like, currently I'm 20 at the time of recording, but, you know, I'm turning 21 in July. This may be releasing in July or later. Um, yeah, I think probably later than July. I think. Um, so, you know, uh, you, you never know, you never know. Like, never assume, never assume someone's age. And even if someone tells you their age, they may just be lying. Like, some people are good at lying, at, like, telling you their age. Like, they'll say an age and you, you'll believe it. Like, oh, that sounds believable. Then it turns out they're, like, 10 years difference and then it's like oh boy oh boy that's more than I thought you are way too old or way too young boy not not personal experience just I know a friend that dated someone who was 10 years old and <laughs> I kind of feel bad for them, but they're also the friend that I mentioned about um, in the Tricky Stuff video that I need to eventually have a talk with. So, on one hand, I feel bad for them. On the other hand, their actions make me, like, doubt them, like, as a person, like, like... That I think they're a good person, just like they've got some flaws, and I I think having a good talk to them may hopefully make them finally realize they may need help. Like I I I'm not saying the name of the friend because you know that's confidential, but you know. Um, I, I think they don't quite realize things like mental, like, illness, whatever you like to call it. Technically, it's not mental illness. Illness is different, but whatever. Yeah, yeah, and I don't know how to say this. Autism <laughs> is my thing sometimes makes it hard with English, but, um, uh, basically I think they're one of those people who can't always realize something immediately, like, I'm pretty sure I've heard of this where, like, people don't, like, understand, like, certain things just because their, their brain, like, it, it, it's sort of like a brain block, like, and in their case, it seems like they don't quite understand the situation, like, how, like, like, autism, like, people with autism or ADHD, like, deal with it, like, they don't wrap their head around the concept of that, like, they seem to, like, what they say seems to, like, seem like, oh yeah, you, you understand, but in reality, from the actions of recently, it seems like it is not that case. Like, the actions go against the words, like, 
it's like contradictory. Actions speak louder than words, as the saying goes. Um, so, you know, yeah. So I want to be there to help them try and understand, like, what they did was probably not the right course of action and they may have overreacted to the situation. Yeah. But, um, yeah. But, um, yeah. Back to Among Us, keep getting off topic. Um, Among Us is cool. It, it, it's, I, I like the eerie music, just the like eerie menu music. It's nice. And yeah, but otherwise, um, yeah, that's it for this one. So yeah, until next time, peace and thanks for watching.